What's up guys? I'm your friend Matthew Ginzali and welcome to a brand new episode of my daily mental health tip series. Now, quick thing though, before we get started, when you're done watching today's video, be sure to check the link down in the description below for today's reading a smile as well as a special written down version of today's talk I'm about to give you. Now, today's mental health tip, my friends, is to treat coexisting disorders you may have. Now, let's face it, coexisting disorders are not exactly far-fetched in the autism world. In fact, they can be rather commonplace. I myself, on top of my initial autism diagnosis, have ADHD. Now, it's not necessarily a problem for me anymore, but it was back in the day. Now, this could totally be something different from you. You might have a different, more destructive coexisting disorder to deal with, and that's okay. Do you know why? Because I know you're strong enough to fight them off both fight both of them off I apologize now let's get something out of the way very quickly you might not even have a coexisting disorder you might be dealing with say just depression or something and you're getting treatment for that and that's good but a coexisting issue could also be there that's another source of stress on top of what's initially stressing you out that could be a toxic family member toxic friend bullying problems in the workplace something impending financial crisis happening, what have you. There can be coexisting disorders and there can be coexisting problems. What I recommend you do for the best possible road towards your recovery is treat both of them. See, if you're just treating the main issue you might have, that's great, that's really great and I'm proud of you for getting help. But if you're not treating this issue or this disorder, it can wreak havoc on your road to recovery and throw you off the trail. Not too far from it, because I know you're smart and can find your way back, but it can be a very big havoc wreaking problem that could arise. Treat both of them, but remember to focus on your main issue that you feel is more pressing and hurting you more, all right? Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to treat your coexisting disorders and or issues you might have struggling with right now. This is your friend Matthew Genzali, and remember, there's always a reason to smile.